Now that restaurants in Bend have been able to have inside diners for a few weeks, they're struggling with a new problem, no-shows. As Leslie Kano reports, some are now changing the way they take reservations. If you're planning at eating out at a local restaurant, you might want to think twice before booking a reservation you don't plan on keeping. And they would say, yes, you know, write me down. I'll be there, and then yes, they wouldn't show up. That's Rosie Westland describing a recent trend she's been noticing of people booking reservations at her restaurant, Wild Rose, and not showing up. As of right now, restaurants in downtown Bend have a 25% indoor seating capacity. Rosie says it's a double sting when someone does have a reservation and cancels last minute or just doesn't show up because she turns away walk-up customers to hold that table. Other restaurants like Ola say they're not comfortable in doing reservation only. Because it's, it's a kind of risky for the business. What about if they don't show up or something like that? And that's why we offer first come first serve. Rosie thinks she's come up with a solution. She's not going to be requiring deposits when people make reservations. It's something she's done before. And so now once our reservation app is like ready to go, we will be requiring a $25 deposit, um, non-refundable that goes towards the meals. She wants people to know how last minute cancellations hurt her business. It's 9:10, and we call him and he says, oh no, I'm not coming. And we were like, okay, well, we'd appreciate it if next time you could just call us and let us know. And he literally said, yeah, no. She told me that people might not be familiar with the deposit process, but says it's a system used in bigger cities when booking dinner reservations. If people are gonna come, they're gonna come. If they want to reschedule, that's fine. They've paid the deposit already. They can reschedule for whatever day. In Bend, Leslie Cano, News Channel 12.